They are the dynasty, the family that ruled Granada for 250 years with 25 sultans, one after another. Okay. The first one, Mohammed the first, is the one who built the Kasbah, the fortress. He built the fortress and then he died very young. The 24 sultans after him, they are the ones who built the palaces, the Medina, because uh, at one point more than 5,000 people used to live in the Alhambra. So the Alhambra was like um, a city within the city of Granada. Yeah. Who was living in the city? The people attending the sultans, the servants, uh, the soldiers, uh, the people attending the market, the madrasa, you know, it was like his, like court, a city. Like his, his court lived in Alhambra? Like his court, like it was his yeah, The servants, his... the servants. Because... Oh yeah, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. So they came and they ruled the Iberian Peninsula for 800 years. The last 200 and 50 years, they only ruled the kingdom of Granada. To begin with, Cordoba was the capital, and they were ruling from Cordoba. What happened? They fragmented into a small kingdom. Every kingdom was called Taiba, and it was ruled by a different emir, a different sultan. So the Christians from the north, they took advantage that the Muslims were not united, and they started the Reconquista. What is the Reconquista? I will just show you in this book. Is it in the gift it? shop? Is this book in the gift shop? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, it's written by one of my professors. Oh. It took him 30 awesome. years oh. to write this book. Oh. Oh. The Summer Palace, as you can see, is outside the wall. But everything is part of the uh, computer. Okay? The first thing that Mohammed the first built was the Kasbah, the fortress. And then the 24 sultans after him, they built the winter palaces, the Medina, and then the Christians, when they came, they also built palaces. You know this square thing here? That is the, the palace of Charles V. He was the grandson of Isabella and Fernanda. And by the way, uh, one of the Isabella's daughter, Caterina, she got married to Henry VIII. That's a catch in the fire, then that's yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, so we But because she couldn't give him some. Yeah, so that was her. We'll be spending their summertime. Okay. Jannat al Arif. are a minority. We are less than 2%. Okay? Even like that, we have agreements with the government by which we are able to buy, to build mosques, yes. madrasas, yes. and we, in aid, they give us a day off and we okay. are able to, you know, to pray yeah. our eight prayers. Okay? Yes. Yes. But please, uh, if you have been to the Albaitin, it's enough. I'd like you to have a picture with the mother. So the key is that the opening from Allah to have a victory or success in this dunya. The second symbol that they use is the hand of Fatima. I'm going to show you the hand of Fatima, symbolizing the five fingers of Islam and also uh, as a protection, as an amulet. And then the show. You know the show? Symbolizing beauty. You know, it's like an invitation for you to be Ibn al 
the sun of the moment. Don't be worried about the past, about the about the motto Wala Ghalif Illallah is written in this line, last line here and above. And then the poem written around the artist is a beautiful poem. It says, Ya Allah, make my life in this earth to be a life that when I die, it will bring me close to you. You know the poem? It was Anne Boleyn who had a terrible time. Yeah, no. And it was her daughter Elizabeth who became the main classic. Right. A girl? Up this way? Yeah, this is an aqueduct. Are you familiar with the aqueduct? He said the first thing that I'm going to build in the Alhambra is a Christian monastery mm. and I'm going to call it San Francisco. Mm. San Francisco de Assis, you know the Italian monk. Yeah. We're just going to go inside yes, quickly. I'm going to have to go home. Okay, I'll explain. Yes. Yes. We need to walk over. Okay. This is the Christian.
allowed me to speak Arabic. And we didn't have to wear something on your face to be recognized on the street. Anyway, there's the faith practice that you didn't want to know. Hi, so it's not a bad thing. Now it's the kind of That he destroyed Sally, eh? About the book. He destroyed a lot of his planners in order to be able to go to Sally. Okay. So we have the book and then the thing that is about to go to Sally. Isabella. Before it was written with wine. <laughs> and then the farmers, uh, they are sorry. I thought this was the farmers. You know, this is the return of Saxon, where they start to fabricate it and join it with that. These are the early things like that. And then the national team is used to decorate artists. Thank you. 